everyone. Welcome to Foresight TV with me, Anjali. Standing tall at a prodigious 8,848 meter, Mount Everest remains the tallest mountain on earth. But there is a growing curiosity as to its growth beyond the present level. We will take you with us in understanding the realities behind the growth of this towering peak as delineated by the service specialist. Here's a special story from Foresight TV. Mount Everest towers 8,848.86 meter above sea level according to the most recent official joint survey by China and Nepal, whose borders run across its summit. But it isn't the only giant in these lands. 10 of the world's 14 peaks higher than 8,000 meter above sea level can be found in the Himalayan range. The history of measuring the tallest mountain in the world stretches back in 1852. In Europe, Charles Dickens was published serialized installments of his novel Bleak House, North America had started testing its first steam-powered fire engine. In Asia, the height of Mount Everest was a mystery. It was known only a peak 15. Radhanath Sikdar, an Indian mathematician, had been employed by the British to work on their great trigonometrical survey. They wanted to gather a more accurate geographical picture of the territory they were occupying so they could control it more effectively, be it for trade or military purposes. Sikdar used trigonometry he measured the horizontal and vertical angles of Everest summit from other mountain tops whose positions and heights were already known. In doing so, he made a momentous discovery. The tallest mountain ever recorded, according to his calculations, the mountain stood at 8,839.8 meter tall. Though the technology behind measuring mountains has advanced since the 1850s, his figure was astonishingly accurate, just 9 meters off the latest official height. Despite Sikdar's findings, the mountain eventually was named after his previous boss, British surveyor Sir George Everest, who had retired several years before Sikdar's discovery. Since then, teams have continued to work to understand Mount Everest height. In 1954, an Indian survey determined Mount Everest to be 8,848 meter tall, a figure which was accepted by the Nepalese government. But then in 2005, the Chinese measured it at 8,844.43 meter, nearly 4 meters lower. In 2020, teams from China and Nepal jointly agreed upon a new officially accepted height that was 0.86 meter higher than the survey of India's original calculation. While these changes in the measured height are partly due to improvements in the measuring technology available to surveyors, there has also been some politics involved. China and Nepal historically have argued over whether the snow cap on the summit should be included in the measurement or not. But we mustn't ignore that Everest also grows a tiny little bit taller every year too. Once the craggy limestone peaks that skim the sky of Everest were on the ocean floor, scientists believe it all began to change about 200 million years ago, at around the time the Jurassic dinosaurs were beginning to emerge when the supercontinent of Pange cracked into pieces. The Indian continent eventually broke free journeying north across the vast swathe of Tethys Ocean for 150 million years until it packed into a fellow continent, the one we now know as Asia around 45 million years ago. Everest is also far from being the fastest growing mountain on our planet. The closest contender for the top spot is perhaps Nanga Parbat, a neighbor to Everest located in the Pakistani Himalayan range, which is 8,126 meter tall and growing at 7 mm per year. In 2,41,000 years, it could overtake Everest to be the tallest mountain on Earth, provided rates of erosion don't change. Others such as those in the Swiss Alps are also growing rapidly thanks to an imbalance in the amount of erosion taking place. Scientists found that uplift in more than 50 times faster than any negative effects from erosion here. But the Swiss Alps are far shorter than Mount Everest and most studies suggest the mountains that are currently growing at 2 to 2.5 mm per year. Meanwhile, Everest retains its allure as a mountain at the extreme of what can be found and endured here on Earth. Its reputation as the highest peak on our planet continues to attract climbers from all over the world, even as its height continues to shift. For most who reach the summit, it is simply being there that counts. Thank you for watching Foresight TV with me, Anjali.